What's up, everyone? It is October, so you know what that means. We got the Halloween theme. We got everything spooky, everything kind of mysterious. Everything that has a thrill to it. Some stuff that is scary, and then some stuff that is just sci-fi. So today, we get to capture one of my favorite, favorite spooky things, and that's aliens, She is so fascinated by aliens. I mean, since I've known her, but it explains it, because her dad was too. He always used to watch the, uh, the ancient aliens yes, documentary. ancient aliens is the best. <laughs> I'm so into extraterrestrials, guys. All the UFO stuff. This is gonna be right up my alley. I was so happy when I saw that it was suggested and what you guys said it would be about. This is going to be, I hope, one of my favorite like Halloween thrill type of movies. If you guys are new here to the channel, though, we welcome you to Rob Squad's home theater. We are watching Signs today. And if you guys are new, go ahead and help us out by liking this video, hitting that subscribe button, and turning on that post notification bell so you never miss a video. As we always tell you guys, before we get started, grab your favorite drink, your favorite snack, and you like it. let's get ready to check this out. Let's go. And, uh, Before we start, quick question: Do you believe in aliens? Yeah. Yeah, you have, of course. You have to believe in aliens. Of course. As big as this, I mean, not just the planet, the universe. We're just, and I've been like um, keeping up with this new telescope. We're discovering more and more galaxies out there that are similar to the galaxy that we live in. And then you got like all the hieroglyphics from like ancient times. Uh, yeah, like, we can go. And not only ancient on and times, on like that. different cultures of the like ancient times and different time periods drew like the alien being yeah. things. She got me watching too much ancient aliens, y'all. <laughs> but no, I definitely I definitely think there's something else out there. So I saw Mel Gibson's name and oh gosh. Joe, Joe Quinn something. It's oh. a big name that's in it that I've heard of acting before. Probably know the face, maybe. Definitely know who Mel Gibson is. Yeah. Already setting us up with some thriller music. Sus yeah, thriller, suspenseful music. You know, the scary movies we watched last year, my favorite were The Shining. And the omen. Not the omen. You haven't seen the omen. What is it? The sixth sense. You need to see the omen. Mm, sixth sense was just such a guy. I liked it. That was just mind blowing the good. twist. Most probably shiny. What is that? Sound like a kid, didn't it? Sound like a kid screaming, yeah. Oh, in a cornfield. Mm hmm You know, cornfields are always like, nothing good happens mm. in a cornfield. It's always like the scariest setting. You can't see where you're going. You don't know where you're at. Like a giant maze. Morgan. Who looks like Macaulay Culkin? Well, what are we walking into? I don't know. Crop circle. Oh. Explain crop circle. How right. you explain it? But imagine that being you, right? Oh. There's, oh, there's more than one. And look at the shape. It's like a symbol. Yeah, like something like that. Like how you? How do you? How that? like make it make sense? If it's not aliens, what can do that? And you could just have a word with him, and that'd be enough for me. See, it was strange finding the crops that way. And the crop circles are always so perfect, mm -hmm. too. I sure take the strangeness away if I knew it was just Lionel and the Wolfenden brothers messing around. He said, I'm not even mad. I just want, like, peace of mind that, like, it was your kid. <laughs> just tell him not to do it again. I was quick, Caroline. I only called you folks two hours. Oh, Mrs. Ken. Hmm. And started spitting on the new skateboards. <laughs> <laughs> Kendallman had sprayed the whole damn place. <laughs> and she or something, I'm telling you, I won't eat for a week. That's nasty. It does yeah. not. Dog. Besides, he licks his butt every day. I don't think he'll mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mm. shoot. What's wrong, boy? He's showing major aggression signs. 
Look at where it's bent over. Uh, you gonna have to go down. You snap at that kid now. The machine can bend a stock of corn over without breaking it. Do you hear that? It's not broken. There's. They can't take a piss without wetting the front of their pants. Mm-hmm. And some of them violent. Uh, like kids the dog are in love was. with that dog right now. Caroline, please stop calling me father. But I was about to say, why is she calling him father? What's wrong? I don't hear my children. That's not a good thing when you don't hear children. Because they can always be heard. <gasps> what? What? You fell on me. You wanted to kill Bo. Oh. You protected us. That's sister. a good big brother. Oh, that poor baby. Oh, that poor baby. That's so weird that the animals are showing aggression like that. Mm -hmm. What a trip to the family that owns them. Because you know that little boy loved that dog. Mm -hmm. I was about to say, poor little boy and girl. Tie Isabel up to the back of the shed, please, and make sure they're not very tight. I don't think he said tie the other dog up. She said, like, it's like for predators around the dog peed on itself yeah, in the kitchen. Yeah, she said showing aggression and, like, mm -hmm. peeing on themselves like there's a predator. So something. The crop circles, whatever did it, must be staying around. That or did something to the animal. Now, see, if she sneaks up on me and says a monster, it's not yeah, I don't like Things the are violence. so weird. Yeah. I'm not walking in there so calmly. Why do you talk to mom when you're by yourself? Oh, we haven't seen your mom. Did you see that? Mm hmm. I was about to say that. And the wolf and your brothers are back. So he thinks it's a human up there. This is his son. Yeah, we'll be doing me a favor. I... <laughs> he said, We'll be doing this. Want me to curse? Yeah, you don't mean it. <laughs> curse and stuff. Make noises then. Explain noises. Because I think he's a preacher or something. That's why she's got him father. Yeah. Ah! I'm insane with anger! <laughs> <laughs> the difference is... <sighs> We're gonna tear your head off! I'm losing my mind! <laughs> <laughs> he's gotta be a preacher. <laughs> got <him. laughs> Yeah. It's like both went around the house and didn't see nobody. Fast footsteps, too. Mm-mm. You going out to Cornfield's chasing for it? See, that's why I couldn't live in the country. Couldn't do it. We just it. had a big old gun cabinet, honey. We would have been all right. <laughs> any little creek I hear outside, bow! You have lots of dogs and guns. <laughs> Man. You gotta have enough dogs to feel like they're a pack and you're good. It only works one way, but that'll do fine. Like as jumpy as I am, I'm saying, let me hear, let me live in the country and hear something out behind some trees. <laughs> bow, bow. Yeah, you'd be too trigger happy. You wouldn't, <laughs> you wouldn't be allowed you. to help. <laughs> I ain't walking nowhere near it. I'm letting that gun go. <laughs> <laughs> you take a glass of water and you finish it. Now, what's wrong with this one? She's been acting so weird about water. Why can't you take a sip and it has his amoebas in it? <laughs> All the waters. See, something's odd about that. Cause first of all, I gotta hand wash all these water, all these glasses. I don't know whether to look for a giant or a midget. <laughs> I, I would uh, say so, yes. Probably. But they don't know what they saw. They right. couldn't describe it. It was very dark. Yes, it was. <laughs> it was dark. <laughs> Our, our roof is 10 feet high. They have women's high jumping in the Olympics. So you can tell me okay, so Olympics everything can be explained by the Olympics you just watched. Clean over me. So you go find that in the middle of the pasture in Pennsylvania. This is the Olympics that you're talking about. She scared a couple of the customers. No one's seen her since. So 
We don't know anything about the person you saw. And we should just keep all possibilities available. So because she has cigarettes, she don't come on my roof. This is when I would use my strong voice. Be like, no, something's happening. I was running <laughs> around outside our house last night. <gasps> Thank what you. What else might be a possibility? <laughs> okay, I was out of line with the whole female Scandinavian Olympian. No, you weren't. I was just toying with us. There's only food under the sofa. <laughs> did you just change the chat? I did. Same show is on every station. He has a really great demeanor with her, though, doesn't he? Turn up the volume. She said sh same shows on. Elaborate hoaxes ever created, or basically, it's for real. Man. Because it's not just, just him, it's around the world. How do you explain that? What in God's name is going on? It's freaky, right? Because there's some news out now about aliens, right? So watching this right now, ooh. I had to think clear, and after that, I'll, I might make some. Now that we realize it's not the but I'll tell Scandinavian you Olympic. There, we'd still go. Jumper. To do is worry about some crazy things happening in the world. I do agree with that, though. I think the cop's a good egg. I just think that she doesn't want to believe, right? So right. she's trying to explain it away anyway. Which a lot but, of people would. I mean, but, that's the first reaction. Right. But how in the world do you get an alien that was on your roof off your mind? There ain't nothing I can do to get my mind off And you're out in the middle of nowhere with like, you know. Reported crop sign found in that country in the last 72 hours. Dang. 18, 72 hours. Come here, are we turn the radio? He's had it rough. You know, you can tell by his face that he's thinking. Yeah, I'm probably going to stay somewhere else for a little bit. Staycation. Let's go get a hotel. But if you can't afford a hotel, right? And you kind of have to be out there because he's a farmer. My little boy is such a good brother. Mm -hmm. He's sweet. Be back for pizza in 15. It's just a bunch of crock. They're trying to sell sodas. Explain. Trying to sell sodas. He's reports since morning. I have seen 12 soda commercials so far. <laughs> Asthma medicine, right, Father? For Morgan Hess. And it's not Father anymore. Now listen to how this person's trying to explain it. Can I ask you a favor? I need to clear my conscience. Oh, wow. Two girls came in here talking about the end of the world. I'm just a little scared. Please, I need to clear my conscience. She needs a confession. Mm -hmm. You see, he's in an enlisting office. Make sure things are all clear. Clear for what? For the rest of them. For the rest of them? He said they're probing like the military right? You got a pamphlet or something I can read? <laughs> that was an intense... <laughs> a general? Got the bat at home. On the wall. You've got two minor league home run records, don't you? Dang. Man. Right? <laughs> yeah, totally. He has the minor league strikeout record. Hold up. Who's this hater? Whip that back through the air as hard as he could. It's like a lumberjack chopping down a tree. He's before his time, so that's all it is now. Strikeouts than any two players. You really got the strikeout right? So they're saying he would swing at anything? Felt wrong not to swing. <laughs> Pumped him a little bit. <laughs> is that right? 13! Don't give me that sauce. Oh my goodness. Shasta. I cursed 37 times last week. I said the F word a couple of times, but mostly... He said, I just wanted to pick up the prescription and go. Is douchebag a curse? I suppose that would depend on its usage. How about, John, you're a douchebag for kissing Barbara? <laughs> There's a guy behind him just waiting to get his medicine. She's getting her confession. What's odd about him? I don't know. Yeah, hope they explain odd. that. Get it, frequency. This crop stuff is about a bunch of nerds who never had a girlfriend in their life. <laughs> Girlfriends before can join in. They do stupid crap like this to feel special. That makes more sense than the Scandinavian Olympian. <laughs> it does. Sure. 
It's just static, Morgan. Uh, just. It's a code. Why can't I get girlfriends? Can I see that, please? Like Morse code? I'm getting out now. That's some it's high getting, frequency. Yeah, it's getting louder. Voices. Did you hear that? Not English, though. You heard the voices, Radical Merrill? Can that kid hear something that they can't? He's just not trying to explain it away. He believes. Probably picking up another baby monitor. That's right. That could happen. Yeah. But you live out in the middle of nowhere. Remember in our old headphones? Mm -hmm. When we would record, we'd sometimes get like a radio station. Do you hear that? That's eerie. I'm letting go now. No, Dad! Don't do it! He'll lose the signal. Don't let go. He's believing or else he wouldn't, he would have mm -hmm. let him let it go. <laughs> She's once up there. Oh, that's cool. What? That's cool. It's like at this point, like I'm staying up and I'm staking out. Yeah. I'm gonna mistake it. I'm gonna I'm going I wanna see one. The dog sounds like it's aggressive right now. <coughs> oh shoot. <coughs> see, I don't care how badly I wanna know, I'm not going out in the cornfield. Mm-hmm. He told the dog that for himself. Oh, I'm definitely not going alone. I'm gonna get my brother. No, he's gotta leave the brother with the kids. Kids can't be by themselves. Oh, something go pop on. I'm on leaning him. in. Oh, it was That's that, the same that sound. Ticking sound. Why? This is why I'm. Hot footing it, high kneeing it back to mm -hmm. the house. Believe it. Oh, I don't like house. it when it pops out. I'm scared what it's going to. Is that a new crop circle? Oh, that's right by him. Looks like it was right next to him. Did you see the leg? Was it a leg? <laughs> Wild. What do they want? <laughs> like, how do you not go inside free? I know, out? but he has to remain quiet yeah. because of the kids, but yeah, I agree. Like, he's gonna sit down and like think about like what he just seen. Wow. Craft from either government's air force. The first sighting was. <gasps> oh. As the unidentified crafts entered Mexico City airspace. What? So he finally agreed to turn the TV on, and this is what you turn on when you see like the UFOs are here. My ballet recital. Dad. Find another tape. Not her ballet recital. Uncle Merrill, I'm using your tape. Swimsuit. What'd it say? Swimsuit. Swimsuit special. Yeah, tape over that. Uncle Merrill does. Like, it's crazy. Like, what if this day comes one day? Who's to say it won't? Like, it's... But your world is shaken up, right? We can sit here and, like, guess at what it would feel like, but their world is shaken up. What a breakdown. And that fills them with hope. Two very different perspectives. Hmm. The stuff in the paper cut next to the sofa. Brandon McKinney throws up all over. <laughs> I knew the second it happened, it was a miracle. I could have been kissing her. She do. That would have scarred me for life. <laughs> that would have scarred me for life. Wow, we went deep to this story. There is no one watching out for us, Meryl. 
We are all on our own. So he's two. I, I didn't expect that. Oh, well, we're a flashback because he's got he's. She's talking. What ambulance is she in? She's not in an ambulance, Father. Who fell asleep at the well? I'm guessing the other person. So he showed up not knowing it was going to be his wife. He thought it was a random accident. Anyways, they closed the schools. And there's been some interesting... They closed schools. Morning. The footage looks like the bird flew into a wall in the sky. So they're invisible. Around their ships. What? They're still there. No, it's not like they're here for good, right? If they're hiding. I think it'd be some kind of... Oh, he's obsessed now. How could you not? Landmark visual mapping systems. It's right outside his door. Courtney. So they can camouflage themselves. That's that's scary. I can't even see it. Oh! <laughs> that is too cute. <laughs> his name. You had a tone. You had a tone. They've used up all the resources on their planet. They're looking to harvest our planet now. <sighs> so it's A or B. Oh. Take that book from them kids. <laughs> Their imagination in a positive way at the moment. Same windows. That's weird. That's weird. <gasps> yeah, I would be confiscating the book. It just amazes me, like, in stories like this or movies like this, like, why don't you just leave? At this point, I'd risk anything. I would just want to get out of there. I don't feel like you could relax in this situation. I think you would be tense. No, I'd be tripping. We're we're going. You said I was gonna die. Oh, I'm sorry if y'all heard my stomach growl. She's intuitive, right? And he wants to do anything to protect her. Did they probe that little girl? No, she's intuitive. He said, Do you have one of those feelings? She has a sense. You hear the dial tone. Is this already in the car? It looks like somebody. I know, right? Is that guy? It is that guy. It had to be at that right moment, that 10, 15 seconds when I passed her walking. It's like it was meant to be. She was a pedestrian. I know what I've done to you. I made you question your faith. I'm truly sorry for what I've done to you and yours. Did he see something? I found one of them in there and locked him in. Well, start with that. I guess he had to like clear his conscience from what he did, but. The startling footage we're about. What? What you're about to see may disturb you. I'm ready. I don't see anything. I didn't see nothing. Move. That's how I feel. Oh. oh. <laughs> it's out in daylight. It's crashing parties. Oh no, we're bold. That thing was huge. Yeah, I'm freaking out. That ain't no little mm -mm. And when there's a crop circle outside my house, you tell me that's what made it? I'm going. What the heck? This man got locked in his car. Why are you going to go in there without the proper authorities? You opening it? No, I'm not opening it. We already took some of your friends downtown in a paddy wagon. Just tell us your name and why you did it, and we'll give you the same deal we gave the others. Throw your life away, son. He thinks it's a common criminal. How did that one dude get it in there? I was just thinking that. Oh, he said he was looking for food and he trapped it. 
Sorry, I want to see it too. It's cute. The thing is saying it's so still and you can't see it. Yeah, I'm going to call the cops to come up here and back me up. He said, I got to check. Yeah, you like, I can't you know. just leave. <gasps> that wasn't a human hand. Did you hear that scream? Did you hear what it did to the bird? Yeah, I believe. Why is he calling somebody? <laughs> Look, he got one on now. They don't like places near water. Be safe from them near a lake or something. Sounds made up. Sort of. They wouldn't be safe anyway. I might be overreacting, but I'm willing to live with that. Either way, at least we'll be together. Oh, yeah, we gotta get up mm -hmm. out of there. For the lake idea, raise your hand. All those in favor of home, raise your hand. <laughs> two, two. <laughs> two, two. Okay. I'm trusting home. <laughs> You lose three to two. Mm. We're going to board up every window in this house. All right. How do real boards will do anything? Because they seem to have trouble with pantry doors. I mean, the most logical you could be at this point, right? I mean, if we're staying, let's go ahead and build up around us. Let's protect ourselves. But we know that they still will move in the middle of the day, right? We saw video of it. We saw that one at the guy's house. Yeah, that one at the little party, though. It's just an eerie feeling because you don't know what they want. As the latest to confirm the appearance of lights. And he still won't tell anybody besides hmm. the local authority. They're appearing at or within one mile of crop signs. Oh, the UFOs. They made them out. Whoa. It's like War of the Worlds. Oh. It's like they have tactics. They're not just popping up. They literally made a map. God be with us all. That's the A group, right? That think there's going to be a higher power to help when they flock through the churches. That's okay. It's heavy for a kid. Ever. I like how Uncle kind of let him know real quick. Yeah. Be grateful for your dad. He's got a good dad. Very patient. Very level-headed. There's too many windows and bedrooms. Right. Oh. I want spaghetti. Oh, it's the fact that they're gonna be so close to him. Mm-hmm. French toast and mashed potatoes. French toast and mashed potatoes. Extra bacon. It's like a last meal type mm. of situation. The somber. Because you don't know what's going to happen. You feel like you're defenseless too. You don't know what these things can do. I'm not going to eat. I'm going to try some of everything. <laughs> oh, this is sad. This is sad. This man has lost all his faith. Oh no. Those clicking sounds. The TV went off. It's that state of emergency sound. Oh. It's happening. Oh my gosh. And it's crazy thinking about it because yesterday was those, that nationwide test. Oh my gosh, yeah. Well, for us, the time we're watching it, not mm -hmm. the time they see it. Man. That dinner scene just like really tug at your heartstrings to see how everybody was falling apart in different ways over this. He saw something. Do you know what it must feel like to look at his kids not knowing how he's gonna keep them safe? And they said we've never seen a baby so beautiful. You smiled. <laughs> She's a special one now. She's special. Oh, man. You hear the dog going crazy. That means it's close. Oh, I'm so nervous mm -hmm. for him. Isabel's gone. I hate the 
sound of a dog whimper. They already know we're here. Yeah. They've been watching them. They've been there for some days now. How is his heart not just completely beating out of his chest? Where's the guns at? He must not have any. Have his guns out. Any. I wish there wasn't babies in the house. They just got one little board up right there. On the main door. Here. While they were fixing her up. While she kept asking him. He's trying to keep his son calm. You first. Because she had dreamed about you. <laughs> you look just how I dream. <laughs> that door. Oh. Attic. You see that hand? I forgot our foil helmets. Oh. <laughs> the foil helmets. I'm already scared. Oh, they're close. I got it! Dad! Did Meryl bust that out? Ugh. Oh, I don't like the darkness. My heart is beating so fast. He's just trying to protect his kids, man. Where is Bo? No way they're gonna let him get this family. But how, do you see a way out right mm -mm, now? Not at all. What's happening out there? Right, we don't know what's going on with the rest of the world. Remember in Predator that that thing would come down every was it so every mm -hmm. amount of years? Hunt. Morgan, give me your flashlight. I'm, I'm confused on what he's figured out mm -hmm. here. He said they're trying to distract him. It must be an old house. It's getting stronger. Get the kids. Let's see what's happening. What is happening? Oh, they were distracting with the door because they were gonna come through the the chute that mm -hmm. he mentioned. The <laughs> can't. It's a little extra. You can't be too safe. We don't have his medicine. He's, he's, oh. He has asthma. He had a fright. He doesn't have inhaler. Don't be afraid, Morgan. Oh, you know what that... Feel my chest. Feel it moving in. I had childhood asthma, the, the feeling of not being able to breathe, but... Stay with me. I know it hurts. This is what she meant. She said something's gonna happen. That girl's been kind of giving me creep vibe, creepy vibes. She's just intuitive. <sighs> oh, I hate watching a little boy have an asthma attack because it feels insane to have one. All he can rely on now is faith. I hate you. I hate you. Don't take the baby. Don't be afraid of what's happening. Oh. Believe. We don't have to be afraid. <laughs> the air is going in our lungs. <sighs> Flashback again. So much, and she's she's talking almost like normal. What? This is the last time I'm gonna talk with my wife. <laughs> the the way they described what's happening to her, it's she doesn't feel anything, but she can still talk. You're lucky as hell they're leaving. They're leaving. That's what they said. They left real fast this morning, like something scared them off. They left some of their wounded behind. What could have scared them off? What? What? I didn't think they I didn't either. One of them I can't take. It was from my older brother, who's everything I want to be. <laughs> it's been like that for a while. He needs his medicine. 
folks glad he's okay. It's good enough for me. Me too. Mm -hmm. You know how ter terrifying it would be to open that door not knowing. Oh. But they can't wait because that is a time sensitive thing. Is, she in the, is that their front door? Where they're leaving it on this shot right here is scaring me like something. I definitely did not think they were gonna make it. Where's the little girl? They're dancing. Yeah, I like guess. <laughs> She's so cute. He's there found a primitive method to defeat them. We have no further details. Yeah, how? In the Middle East, some they found something. He said. <laughs> no, no, come on. Uh uh. You gotta be joking me. The heck? Does it have the little boy? What is that thing? <gasps> What's it taking? It's the one he cut the fingers off of too. It is. It's the one that was locked in the closet that he it couldn't get back on the ship. <gasps> what is he doing? Right when we're settling down, what's he doing? Dinner. You love hawks. <laughs> to play games. It's okay to be silly. I will. <laughs> I think better not. Bat. His brother's a baseball player. Swing away. You see the look off Meryl's face. Yeah, I'm trying like, to. It's like you can see the puzzle pieces fitting together. Well, beat the brains out that thing. He's a hitter now. He's a slugger. Ah! What did he do? When he connects, he can connect now. Water. Water. Oh, and he knows there's a lot of water laying around. That little girl. Wow, this is fate. This is all fate. This is what we've been talking about the whole time. He's just gonna break up with the things of water. What did he put in the case? They said they have a small amount of poisonous gas that does something to humans. Remember when that one guy said, I heard we'd be safe next to large mm. bodies of water? What? Oh, he broke his bat. His lungs were closed. His lungs were closed. Don't His lungs were closed from the asthma, and that's why he's saying that's that no poison can get in because his lungs are closed. He couldn't breathe it, breathe, breathe it in. Second. Daddy? What? Dad? <laughs> Someone did. And they were saying earlier, can't nobody save us. Somebody saves you, baby. Premonitions. All the things that fell together to make this work. He went back. <laughs> he did, didn't he? His faith has been restored. It's been restored. This whole thing has been somebody looking out. <laughs> uh, Midnight Sh uh, Sh Shyamalan? Is that how you pronounce it? Yeah, that's a big name. That was phenomenal. That was a really good movie. First thing I want to talk about those like everything that tied in together. So. The Ray guy said, like, he never falls asleep. Like, it's happened, happened, like, that 10 to 15 seconds. He was like, he, he said. I forgot about him saying that. He said, it's almost like it's meant to be. Then his, then, and then his wife said it was meant to be. And then the Ray guy told him about the water. And the water killed yeah. them. And then the wife told the husband, you know, tell him to swing away. And then he thought about it. And they kind of went two and two. And they swung away and ended up killing the alien. I thought that this signs so movie much. was going to be the crop circles were signs, right? So I thought that was the signs. But I didn't know that there were so many signs that were going to lead up into 
this playing out the way it played. Right. Like the boy right. having asthma and his lungs being closed, so no poise can come through. The little girl loving, wa- well, having problems with water. So there's so I was wondering, like, what is? How are they gonna make that make sense in this movie? So there's all the water around, and then when she's and he said, you know, my wife. The last thing she said to me, like, obviously her brain endings were just firing away. It didn't even make sense. She said, swing away. Mm. Tell, tell Meryl to swing tell away. Tell Meryl to swing away. And he thought nothing of it. And then to kind of see how it all unfolded at the end, where he put the signs together and he realized that what she meant. And so that's what's crazy is for her to have that premonition and to be able from, you know, six months back, know what's going to happen and help save her family. I definitely thought the whole thing was going to be about the crop circles and aliens. Me too. I, you, know, you know, like you said, you know, then you get kind of the the sad ending. But I, I definitely did not think they were going to make it out of that. I thought they were trapped down there. I thought the aliens were going to outsmart them. But the way it ended, it went so, so well. Like, like I mean, it sounds bad to say, but like, what a convenient time to, to have, you know, for your lungs to be closed. Yeah, yeah, for your lungs to be closed. And the alien you know, thought he was going to kill him, but he, he ended up not doing it. And then, you know, his the, the preacher, his faith gets restored. So I thought it was awesome. And I really thought, you know, he, um, Morgan, the whole brother, he was a great big brother to his little oh, sister. I, me, I had right. the best big brother, and, and then Meryl was a great brother yeah, for, to the other guy. It well. was, so he I was. thought it was really, really sweet. I, I enjoyed this movie. For of sure. all the things you could yeah. live through, I think an alien invasion would probably be top tier worst thing that so you could much, live through. Not the, just like a pandemic, right, no. Right. Because there's so much unknown. There, yeah, and so that's, that's the thing. The, the storyline in this was so 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 great you know how they made them appear with the crop circles and with the ufos and you know how we got to see like the tv and just like you know the mania that was happening around it and then to see it all wrap up and you know i'm gonna say us because i felt like a team effort at the end you know you know the humans you know making it out of what we didn't think they were gonna make it out of was it was just an all around interesting, amazing it was, movie. It was pretty wild. It makes you think, like, what if? Like, what if this No, we don't really talk about that happen? after this what movie. If? I like talking about aliens, but, like, don't talk to me about aliens after this movie. <laughs> That's not what I was expecting. But guys, thank y'all so much for the suggestion. We hope you enjoyed this as much as we did, as we always send you out of here, no matter what channel of ours it's on. We love you. We thank you. We appreciate you. And remember, every day that you wake up, it is a blessing and that you are blessed. And for your new family members, hit that subscribe button down below. We welcome you guys to the RSR family, but y'all have a go every day just like we do. Let them know, Ma. Make somebody smile, you guys. We love you guys. So next time, we'll see y'all later.